Such a good sleep. Do you ever have one of those brow days where they're just not working and you try and fix them and they just keep getting worse? That's me today. So just ignore what I got going on up here. So since I have twins, I have a ton of stuff. Like this room is filled to the brim. And I still have a whole just dryer full of stuff that I also need to bring in here still. So since I have this change table, and underneath is really just my diapers and that kind of stuff. I have cloth diapers down there. Um, but just like the actual disposable diapers and the creams and stuff, I'd like to put up somewhere else that I can maybe access a little bit easier. Um, and use that space for something else, like larger blankets and towels and stuff that's just not used as often. So I got this cheap little spice rack. And I just painted it with a nice metallic spray paint that I used for these pipe shelves that I have on my wall and I'm just gonna hang it on the wall and hopefully have some extra storage so we'll see pieces to hold it into the wall and as I was hammering it in after I drilled the hole for it it just kind of like collapsed and crushed so those are happening but luckily I'm not really putting that much weight in any of this so it should be fine hopefully um so then I tried just screwing drilling drilling the screws in is that what it is drilling the screws in to the wall and this does not fit anywhere around here, like, to actually screw it in. You just kind of hit this. So, yeah. Awesome. So now I have resorted to just getting a screwdriver. Three screwdrivers, because I don't know which one's going to fit. Um, and hopefully we'll get it done. We'll see. <laughs> So, 
I am not Tim Toolman Taylor. I'll tell you that right now. So, let's see if it holds anything. Alright, here's a cute little rack. It works pretty well. As long as it doesn't fall. But, <laughs> we'll see. Um, I was going to put like these wipes over there. But, it's just a lot easier I think to grab them right here. Um, I might move them. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. So now I have all of this. And this to put away. Oh yeah. It never ends. So I don't know if anyone necessarily cares or is interested in what kind of cloth diapers I use. Um, I honestly don't use them that often just because I don't have enough. And I have a decent stash. If I had one baby, then it'd probably last like two or three days. Um, but with two, it makes them through like a day and a diaper or two each. The brand that I have most of um, is the Charlie Bananas. I tried a couple others and the quality of them is just not the same. I don't really um, wash and take care of mine the way I should. I just kind of stick them in the dryer on a low heat, like a delicate. Um, I do have the laundry line to put them outside, but I just never have. It's too much work for me. And they still absorb okay with the um, dry. So everything's folded. I just need to put everything up and away and still figure out how I'm going to reorganize in here to fit everything. Um, side note, does anybody know how to get rid of sweet potato stains on a baby clothes? It's everywhere. <laughs> Let me know. Alright, so I've been working in here for a while now and I think I finally got it good enough for now. Um, just kind of move stuff around a little bit, so this is what it looks like now. My new little rack right there, and then my laundry bin like always. Down here I have my cloth diapers and inserts and some towels and sheets. My pails. Just like extra stuff. Other stuff's over here kind of organized a little better. I put their jackets in that black little cloth bin right there. And then all their clothes. Well, almost all their clothes are still over here. <laughs> and I can actually walk in here now without stuff all over the floor, which is super nice. So that's so it. I'm just making another little craft with um, the baby's handprints for Jacob just to send him. Um, I made him a footprint one for Valentine's Day, but uh, does anybody else have a really hard time free handing a heart, like just cutting it out? Look at all these scraps, <laughs> and I ended up with this lumpy little thing. So just me? So I just finished my little craft oops, that I'm going to send him and what it is is just this little heart, the hands, when you open it, it says I love you, this much, just something cute and little and they both do the same thing as you saw the other one already exploded and I just got these, I took these two cute little Polaroids of them. <laughs> All of her is funny. Yep, and I'm just going to send it off to him. And that's it. Just a cute little package for him. Somebody just woke up from a nap. <gasps> Say hi. Hi.
<laughs> Don't pull harder. Does anybody else have this problem?